lifetime, I've witnessed a terrible decline in yours. You could and should witness a wonderful recovery. That desperate hope, ladies and gentlemen, delicate, excellency, is why the world is looking to you. That number suddenly stabilized, and with it, Earth's climate. We found ourselves in an unusually benign period, with predictable seasons and reliable weather. For the first time, civilization was possible, and we wasted no time in taking advantage of that. Everything we've achieved in the last 10,000 years was enabled by the stability during this time. The global temperature has not wavered over this period by more than plus or minus one degree Celsius until now. One burning of fossil, our burning of fossil fuels, our destruction of nature, our approach to industry, construction and learning are releasing carbon into the atmosphere at an unprecedented pace and scale. We are already in trouble. Today, those who've done the least to cause this problem are being the hardest hit. Ultimately, all of us will feel the impact, some of which are now unavoidable. Is this how our story is due to end? A tale of the smartest species doomed by that all too human characteristic of failing to see the bigger picture in pursuit of short term goals. Perhaps the fact that the people most affected by climate change are no longer some imagined future generation, but young people alive today, perhaps that will give us the impetus we need to rewrite our story.